This man looks like a lechon pig at a Filipino <laughs> barbecue. <laughs> Dog, I have never sweated so much for doing absolutely nothing. This man is moist. I'm moist, dude. Wow. I'm Timothy De La Ghetto. And I'm David So. We travel around to different food festivals where we eat all the eats, we drinks all the drinks, and we get all types of crazy while giving you guys the most raw and realest food reviews in the game. This, this is Send Foods. What's up, you sexy mother Welcome to another episode of Send Foods on Thrillist. I'm Timothy De La Ghetto. I'm David So. It's so hot. It's so hot, but we out here in Sh Shawshank Redemption, Sh Shish Kebab, no, we out here in beautiful Chicago, home of the Bears, home of Kanye West, home of Chance the Rapper. We out here at the Taste of Chicago because we heard they got the most fire food out here and I'm ready to eat. What are you excited for? Man, I'm excited for these um little uh, cheesecake. cheesecake. I'm excited for these uh, alligator sausages that I heard are supposed to be popping. I'm actually excited for cheesecake now. <laughs> yeah, no, they hypnotize me. This motherfucker is like, they all camera, cheesecake! <laughs> What else are you excited for? Uh, I'm excited for actually something that Chicago people don't really f that much. Apparently, deep dish pizza. Deep dish pizza. I, I guess Chicagoans, real Chicagoans, don't really eat deep dish and like that. You guys that. tricked us, man. We about to find out. <laughs> Appreciate you. All right, All right man, take care. Kim comes up to that guy's nipples. It's crazy. He's huge. It's not even human. Hey, Tim, I'm a big fan of yours, too, man. Hey, can I get a picture, too, real quick? <laughs> All, right. All right, there you go. You know what it is, man? It's, it's, it's not even the fact that it bothers me that I don't get noticed. I only get bothered when it's an Asian person. Oh, my God, look at this girl's getting all by. Oh, my God. Yeah, yeah, let's take a picture. Let's take a picture. Let's take a picture. We're at the uh, Chicago Dog House. So we got... Uh, Alligator, rattlesnake, rattlesnake, rabbit, and another alligator. Hey, you know, fun fact: there's an, actually an alligator that's running loose out here in Chicago right now. Chance the snapper. Chance the snapper. Isn't that adorable? I'll try the rattlesnake. You try the alligator. Okay, okay. All right. And cheers. Here we go. Uh huh. Mmm. Oh, hot. Mmm. That's good, dude. Right off the bat. Before I even tasted it, sausage got a fire snap to it. You know, sausage got that good casing around it. A little snap to it. Yep. I like it. A little snap to it. I f love it. But you know what's interesting? Because I know that alligator tends to be a little lean. The fat ratio in this is f good. Is it? So, so I don't know what extra fat they put in this, but it's delicious. Hey, it's good. It's really good. It's really, really good. Hey, no lie! <laughs> No, 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 wait! <laughs> All right, so we're here at Ibolina's Tamales, and we're about to have some vegan tamales. I have today a quinoa lentil tamale with vegan um, cauliflower ceviche, what? and vegan red mole and vegan green mole. So why do you feel like we need vegan tamales and vegan ceviche? Why, why are, you, are you vegan? I'm vegetarian, yes. I am allergic to pork. I can't consume any pork, pork products. Tamales are made with lard, mm. and... Of course, I can't consume it, so. Vegans are changing the world, David. One, one tamale at a time. She actually did a really good job of making this look like ceviche. It looks great, right? It looks like, like you would never notice some cauliflower when you first walk up on it. Let's do ceviche first. Okay, okay, okay. All right, cheers. Flavor's on point. The flavor's on point. The consistency doesn't yeah. taste like seafood, but the flavor's on point. If I was a vegan that cared about the animals of the sea, then sure, bring me the cauliflower ceviche. Also, shout out to Black Ariel. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go for the green mole. No manteca at all. Okay, then I would try the red mole or the brown, this brown mole right here. Cheers, sis. Huh. That's good. That is good. I like the sweetness of this brown one. Hey, she yeah. ain't playing. Yo, man, if you vegan and you love tamales, dude, you gotta f*** with it. This is good. If you're not vegan. Oh, yeah, you might not even need the f fat. Yeah, because, you know, me, my, my cholesterol is high. I blame Thrillist. I'm going to sue y'all soon. <laughs> <laughs> but if I, if I can avoid some lard in my food, 
I gonna do that? The great thing about this mole, just like other moles have, it has that nice deep roasted flavor in it. Wow. Super savory and that sweet tamale with it. Oh you can my tell, God, you can tell bro. she knew exactly what she was doing and when she did it. Yeah, I mean definitely because like that pork fat's not there, the consistency of the tamale is a little different, but not in a bad way. But I don't mind. Different. It's different. Yeah. It just but it tastes good. This is probably the best vegan dish I've had so far on the show. Damn. Boom. I really love your podcast on Genius Brain. Oh, thank you so much. See that? Adults like David Sill, little kids like Tim. <laughs> that was the Everyone? first non-Asian that has ever come up to me. I've made it. All right, so we had the Bites Asian Kitchen and Bar. Can we get the Japanese corn dog and the elote? Have you seen the show called Wild and Out? Yeah. That's where he's from. I'm the token Asian on Wild and Out. Oh, and I don't know if you recognize him if you saw the movie Up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you ready? Yeah. Ah, uh, cheers. Boom. What kind of mayo is on here, bro? Doobie mayo. Doobie mayo. Doobie mayo. What's that mean? Doobie mayo is a Japanese mayo. It's a little more tart, a little more sweet, and a lot more eggy. Trade these. Trade these. I like to put stuff because you know you get a good deep fry on something without being too greasy. You know. Oh. Um. Okay, homie. Hmm. I like it because like you got the sauciness of the sausage with the sweetness of the what sauce is that? Tonkatsu sauce. Tonkatsu sauce, I know that. A regular corn dog, you know, it tastes like some American shit. You know, it's like a pancake wrapped in a hot dog. This right here, you definitely taste the Asianness of it, the different sauces, the uh, and the immediate uh yeah, that's it. <laughs> Alright, so we have the kitchen 17 pop-up. If you guys are a Lord of the Rings fan, apparently the man who owns this place is Hordor. He's he's, he's. <laughs> No, Game of Thrones. Uh, what was it? What was it? You said he's a Lord of the Rings. Let's really do that joke. The interesting thing about this. Oh, let's start again. Also, if you're a Game of Thrones fan, Hordor owns this place. Look at this mother. He's goddamn big, dude. Can we please get some deep dish pizza? Thank you so much. He's gigantic. Hold the door. All right, so now we're about to try their vegan deep dish. Now, Chicago, I thought was known for the deep dish, but everybody we talked to from Chicago was like, nah, we don't with the deep dish. I'm glad we're eating vegan pizza because if you guys remember in past episodes, I was popping lactate pills thinking they were gonna help me offset what the cheese does to my skin, but I was completely wrong. My is up right now. I got a lot of makeup on. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just. Yeah, just go bite yeah. it. Ooh, I'm gonna do a Tim thing and I'm gonna eat the ass. Yo, look, right off the bat, I cannot tell that that's vegan. It tastes like lasagna on pizza. Whatever bootleg cheese they're putting on there, when I bit it, you know, it tasted like like meat and cheese. All right, so we're taking a break from eating to pet some bugs. David, you gonna pet some bugs? With I'm me? just gonna pet you, and through that, I'll pet the bug. <laughs> you feel, you feel, feel the bug connection. <laughs> yeah, man. Just, these, these doesn't look like the roaches I grew up with, though. This is way bigger. <laughs> I actually don't mind uh, cockroaches because I used to take care of Madagascar cockroaches in high school. Did you? Yeah. What a nerd! I was failing class, so I had to. <laughs> Rosie the tarantula. Tim, don't do it. Is this the butt side or the head side? Yeah, that's the thorax. Oh, sh. Hey, Rosie, thick. Yeah. And now uh, let's have a snack. Hey, no racial, this is Asian yeah. people. Sh <laughs> <laughs> yeah, facts. I haven't eaten some bugs since I was in Thailand. So. I'm telling you. Okay, manayan, honey mustard, or sriracha? Let's get Asian to the max and give us the sriracha. The sriracha. Yeah, 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 please. What kind of bug is that? It's a cricket. Oh, cricket. I love crickets. Oh, Cheers. look at that. All right. All right. Tastes like nuts. Tastes like corn nuts. It's not bad, man. When the world goes to sh this is what we'll be eating, my friends. So get yeah, they're gonna, they gonna be eating us when the world goes to. Sh yeah, you don't like me. I don't taste good. I'm bitter and salty. Oh, thank you. What is this again? Uh, mealworm. Mealworm. Something. Mealworm. I like the mealworms over the grasshoppers. Are you serious? Bro, you popped out of nowhere, man. That scared the <laughs> f out of me. We just gotta have a, a, a random person to always go, Are you serious? <laughs> Would you pop up for everything? That was the sweatiest man I've ever seen. Are life. you serious? Oh my god. <laughs> All right, so we out here at Eon Zay. This right here is some jollof rice with oxtail, and I just Googled it. Jollof rice is like basically just they, they put a whole bunch of sh in a pot. And we over here got the classic jerk chicken. And I'm gonna tell you something right now. Look at that spice crust, homie. Mmm. Delicious looking. And it's under a bed of rice. You can see all the herbs. And of course, you got some fried plantains, I believe. Cheers. Mmm, 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 mmm. Okay. Mmm. I love me some oxtail, man. Nice and fatty. You suck the bones. 
very smoky. I mean, the char on the outside is amazing, man. Whatever sauce that they had on it, right when it hit that hot grill, it put this delicious crust on it. Switch. Switch. Cheers. Spicy. Oxtail fire. Mm -hmm. It's good. You got some food on your team. Oh, good. Me it's neither. Good. Mm. So now we got some Nigerian donuts. Now we used to the skinny white people donuts, but we got the Nigerian fluffy donuts. You know what I'm saying? This looks like my ball sack after a hot shower. Anyways, whoa, these are hot. Yo, this <laughs> mother is, she thick as bro. This is a thick ass donut. Cheers, hot too. Okay, ready? Eat the booty. Mm, ooh. Damn. It's hot. It's hot. It's doughy. Soft. Sweet. It actually has like a savoriness to it. It's super dense, but it's not dry. Like it's mad moist on the inside. Ow, 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 it's hot. Hey, what was your favorite thing you ate today, David? My favorite thing that I ate today definitely had to be, surprisingly, the Vegan tamales. The vegan tamales I loved. I also liked, I really liked the uh, the oxtail. You know oxtail used to be, oh, who cares, huh? No, tell <laughs> us, please, tell us, David. Oxtail used to be really cheap until white people started buying it. <laughs> My God, <laughs> white people, I love you so much. Thank you guys for watching another episode of Send Foods on Thrillist. Hey, make sure you guys let us know in the comments below where we should go to next, what city, what food festival, because like, as you know, we're doing these shit every week now so we need suggestions okay and like we've been doing lately shout out to the people leaving comments below shout out to Kayla strong she says she hopes we never stop shooting these so hey as long as thrillers keeps giving us money we out here shooting this shit. make sure you like this video comment subscribe share with your peoples because if no one watches thrillers is going to be like oh come on what the f we shooting <laughs> are you serious <laughs>